Hello, I'm Kareen, and welcome back to a new you. Diamonds are a girl's best friend, or so they say. We are so excited to chat to Vernon White today and visit his gorgeous store. Vernon has been in the jewellery industry for the past 20 years and prides himself on quality workmanship. His company designs, manufactures and remodels classic and contemporary jewellery, ranging from diamond rings, chains, pendants, bracelets and so much more. Vernon has won numerous awards, registered a design internationally and has two patents. His jewellery is truly spectacular. Welcome, Vernon. Thank you for joining us today. Thanks for having me. And thank you so much for being part of a new you and Lianka's journey. We're so excited to have you share this time with us and to visit your beautiful store. And I'm so lucky today to be wearing your jewelry. Oh my gosh, it is just spectacular. Tell me a little bit about this piece and also like this piece, for example, because this is actually a pendant that you can make into a ring. So tell me, are they both patented? Tell me a little uh, bit more. The, the ring, it's called an eternal pendant, which we've patented. Yes. Um, it unclips, it's got a safety uh, mechanism, so it can't fall off. And you can unclip it and attach it to a chain. So you can wear it as a pendant or as a ring, uh, whichever you prefer. And then the pendant, um, with all the rioting and everything, I, yes. I designed it around the lighthouse, uh, the oyster box lighthouse. And uh, I just thought it would be a nice, thing to give to somebody as a sign of protection or oh, um, that is so beautiful yeah that's very special and tell us a bit about yourself and about Vernon White and your jewelry I mean 20 years that's quite a long time in the industry yeah I've, uh, I used to surf a lot uh, when I was younger and did the European tour surfing and got involved with jewelry there just playing around in the winters wow and came back here and did an apprenticeship and and then borrowed a bit of money had a little workshop set up and i was doing a lot of work for the chain stores okay. and slowly i built up my own client base and then one of my clients was a letting agent for one of the malls and from there i basically took a shop in the mall and slowly just built up from there um, Wow, that's fantastic. Yeah. So it's quite a journey you've had from a surfer, from surfing to jewellery. Yeah. But your designs are just so beautiful and your shop is so stunning. Thank you. And tell us a little bit more about your patents. How does that all work? Well, basically, if, if you have an idea and you want to keep it exclusively, exclusively yours, yes. um, you basically take, find a patent attorney and then take okay. out a patent on it so that nobody can knock it off hopefully. And what designs have you patented? You, um, you mentioned this, this one? Uh, the eternal pendant yes. and then the string that I'm wearing now. Okay. There's a lot of variations on it but it has all the countries around the world around the one side and then the center clicks like a watch bezel. It actually has a clicking mechanism oh and my gosh. it's got all the time uh, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, you know, 24 hours around yes. and if you're in London at 2 o'clock you line London up with two o'clock, it tells oh. you what time it is in all the other countries around That's the world. Incredible. Mm. Gee yeah. whiz. And I mean, you design, you're a designing jeweler, so you design all your own um, work. Do a lot of people come in and they say they want certain things and do you advise them? How does that all work? Yeah, that's basically mm. mostly what we do if somebody's looking for an engagement ring. We try yes. to make it unique, so mm. it's a one-off. It's not something that you could buy from a chain store. Yes. Um, and we try and add a few of the things that they like. So may, they might like something from one ring and something from another ring. Yes. And we'll combine the two or three or four and make up the ring exactly um, the way they like it. You know? Oh, uh, divine. Well, I know where I'm going to come. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, you have a store in Gateway, don't you, as well as at the Oyster Box? Yes, we've got a little... Uh, display unit there oh, um, okay. with some of our jewellery there. But your factory is off-site, isn't it? Our factory is off-site. It's in Florida Road, yeah. Okay. And how We're long actually it, busy in the process of moving it to Mschlange now. That would be yeah. better for you, yes, hey, closer. Yeah, but we've been in the, on the Berea for at least 20 years. Uh, yes. Yeah. You don't have a store there, it's just your factory? No, just our factory. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But we do see clients there sometimes. Yes. Yeah. And what are you going to show us all your different beautiful jewellery today? 
yeah, we we'll show you some of our necklaces that Lovely. we've made, some of our rings. Another ring that we've designed for men is a Formula One uh, okay. ring. It's based on the Formula One car tire. The ring box is a Formula One car tire. Um, Gee, that's wonderful. Yeah, that's very popular. Um, we do okay. it in all different materials and with rubber inlays, uh, diamond, black diamonds, white oh. diamonds if they prefer. So do you find that men are enjoying and, and wearing a lot more jewellery these days? Yeah, it has. Becoming popular. Yeah, it has. Yeah. Some men are more bling than the yes, <laughs> than yes. their fiancés. Well, oh, uh, really? Rings, yeah. Gosh, well, I love your ring. I notice there is quite a lot of bling. It is shiny. Yeah, it's, it's, it's bling, but it's a little bit subtle. It's yes, black no, it's diamonds. not over. Oh, yeah. no, it's absolutely stunning. Yeah. And do you find black diamonds are becoming quite popular now? They are very popular. Yeah. yeah, with ladies as well as gents. Uh, more with gents. Yeah. Okay. They used to be popular with ladies, but yes. I think uh, ladies tend to like the the, the real sparkle. sparkle. Yeah. Yes, exactly. Yeah. And do you like jewellery? Oh yes. I'm Who very does excited. it? Oh, <laughs> lovely. And what is your plan today with Lianka? We plan to uh, dress her in one of our lighthouse pendants. Oh, um, wonderful. Yeah. <laughs> so you're going to be so spoiled. That's so stunning. Oh, lovely. Well, we look forward to now having a look through all your jewellery. I uh, cannot wait. I cannot try on some pieces, please. Absolutely. <laughs> that is like my best. You're I always, a good advert. Yes, exactly. I always want to go into jewellery shops and try everything on. But thank you so much for your time, as I said, and being part of Lianka's journey and for spoiling her with such a special piece. Because I think, uh, the, like you say, the lighthouse pendant, that's... It's got meaning behind it. Huge yeah. meaning. I mean, we've all been through such a time now, you know, and I think that that is, is very special. So you designed that just recently? Yes, through. yeah. So, uh, literally since all yes, the... Yes, since all this happened. Yeah, yeah. Oh, lovely. Yeah. Well, well. But it's already been quite popular. I yeah. can imagine. Yeah. Well, you're a true master in your, in your field, really, and we're so proud to have you as part of Belito TV's and new you. So thank Thanks. you, Vernon. Thanks for having me. Yeah, I know. And I look so forward now to going and trying on some pieces and to <laughs> seeing what you're going to be spoiled with. Thank you, Vernon. Thanks, Karine. So as you can see, Vernon is truly a master in his field. And for any of your jewellery requirements, please contact him and visit his gorgeous store at Gateway. Remember these powerful words. Live as if you were to die tomorrow. Learn as if you were to live forever. See you next week.